Morning, guys. It is the 1st of March. Can you believe it's the 1st of March? It's Friday. And I'm at my mum's. And as I pull up on her drive, it starts hammering down. So I'm just waiting for the shower to stop. I didn't video yesterday because I was busy doing stuff and I went out for dinner with some friends. And these particular friends aren't overly enthralled when we're videoing them. So I just didn't bother videoing yesterday. Um, yeah, I went out for food. And then I did a late night dash to Tesco. Well, it wasn't a dash, late night waddle to Tesco. I came back and picked up Dexter. Jackson had to wear something red. The kids have suddenly had like this massive growth spurt. Nothing fits them. I need to do a serious clothes shop. That's where I miss going car boot sailing because um, I used to get so many good clothes for kids when they were younger. Don't think you get as much good stuff when they get older because kids obviously wear out stuff. But when they were babies, I practically clothed them at the car boot sale. We used to get brilliant stuff, tags on, everything. Anyway, I picked up a rugby top and some joggers and uh, just a few bits. Um, I wasn't in there long. And then I've just been sitting down looking at a cookbook before I came out to get inspiration for tea tonight. And it is the new cookbook that Kieran has brought out from Grow. And he kindly sent me one. And I was having a look through it and he had pizza top chicken and I know how to cook pizza top chicken because I cook it all the time but when I seen it I thought yeah that's what I'm going to do for tea because I had to buy chicken fillets last night because um Jackson's got cooking today and he's making chicken nuggets <sighs> and I had to get chicken um so what I've done is I've given him one chicken breast that's all he had to take Oh, it's cold, yeah. One chicken breast, which leaves me with five chicken breasts, which isn't enough because I feed my mother. So I just took two chicken breasts out of the freezer because I couldn't be bothered to take chicken out of the freezer last night to defrost in readiness for Jackson. And another reason I didn't take chicken out of the freezer for Jackson is because the chicken I've got in the freezer is ex the Tesco finest expensive one that's actually looks yellow. I think they're corn fed chicken. And I thought to myself, if I defrost and give him one of them, all the other kids are going to be like, oh, your chicken's off. When it's not, it's yellow because what they feed the chickens on. So I just took two out, two out so we've got enough chicken for later and I don't have to buy more chicken. Although I'll probably end up buying more chicken to make recipes over the weekend. Um, my mother wants to go out. I've actually got my hairdressing kit in the back. I'm not in the mood for cutting my mother's hair. But I told her I'd cut it on Wednesday and I forgot my stuff and I couldn't be asked to go back to the house. I think she was a bit disappointed. I said, oh, I'm not cutting your hair now. I'll do it Friday. So here we are Friday. I, uh, oh. I can't be asked, but I'll cut it for her lover. My mother's hair is a bit wild. It's coarse. It's very coarse, like my hair. A bit like horse's hair. Just going to see if she's opened the door. No, she hasn't. She probably haven't noticed I'm here yet. Um, her hair is very coarse and very fuzzy. So I'm going to cut her hair for her. And I'm going to go home and make a shopping list. She wants to go to Home Bargains. Warren needs coffee beans. He had a go at me this morning. He got up. I was downstairs. And he's like, can't have coffee now. I don't drink coffee, so I don't understand how people can't 
function without a coffee because I've never been a coffee drinker. And he's like, I haven't got coffee now. I've got to go work and I haven't got coffee. So I was like, well, have one of the sachets out your back. They're not, they're in work. Told you I needed coffee. He never, he never told me he needed coffee. I said, I would have got you some if you needed coffee. I've had an email. I've been shopping on TikTok shop. <laughs> yes, TikTok shop. I've ordered a few bits of tat. I've ordered um, a clamp thing to hold my phone. I had one before, but it broke. It's basically like a big massive clip and you can clip it onto your unit or your table. Uh, holds your phone. I've ordered these. I've ordered these things that look like an old fashioned, what I remember that you'd put a bar of soap on. Um, it's like suckers all over and I'll put a picture up there and you can basically stick it to the back of your phone and then you can stick it to something. So I thought that'd be handy to stick to the unit in the kitchen if I was uh, talking to you guys or something. What else to buy? I bought some cloths for the kitchen, like scouring cloths. Fluff on me. What else to buy? Oh, and I bought the kids. I say the kids. I bought three lots of freeze dried sweets. Be handy if they come today because I'm going to bingo tomorrow night with Michelle. And uh, she was like, Oh, I haven't tried freeze dried sweets. So I said, Oh, if they come, I'll bring some. But I have a feeling that the stuff coming today is only the phone suckers and the cloths. We shall see. And as far as doing the dehydration freeze dried effort, one of you guys kindly explained what it was. I think, yeah, I think you said your husband was a chef or something. But you basically told me that dehydration and freeze dry is nothing alike. So it's not, I'd, I'd love to be able to make freeze dried sweets though, because they're freaking amazing. Uh, I know you could buy a machine thing for it, but oh, you know me and machines and gadgets. You never know, one might end up in um, a shopping basket. They're probably expensive though. <laughs> Um, so yeah, I've got no plans for breakfast at the minute. I, um, I've been using the an MM cream, IMIM, morning and night on my eyes. I have noticed they are a lot softer. I don't know that it's done that much for my wrinkles because I'm not that wrinkly. However, as I'm getting older and lost some weight my neck's going like a wrinkled old chicken fillet i don't know whether it'd work on that but yeah i will give you a proper update very shortly on that cream and also you'll get a discount code with it if you fancy purchasing it um but yeah my day i'm quite looking forward to going out with michelle tomorrow night because we have a good laugh and i need a good laugh because yesterday when I wasn't filming, I was um, miserable. I wasn't miserable because I wasn't filming. I was just miserable. I put on Facebook I was feeling fed up. And uh, I was just like being a Karen. I was very moody. I was uh, just miserable. Miserable. I feel a bit better today. It would be nice if the sun could shine. Oh, I bought Dexter a sewing machine. I gave in and I bought him a sewing machine. However, don't be thinking, oh, I've gone and bought him a 200 quid sewing machine. I bought him a mini sewing machine off eBay, right? It was £15 something. And this is it. And... It does the job. It's going to be a five minute one done. 15 quid is, you know, 15 quid in it. 15 quid these days is bugger all. So 
and I thought if he really does get into sewing then I'll spend the money and buy a decent one well anyway it came um I hid it when it came because he was in school and I thought I want the guinea pigs cleaned out and he's like last few times I've done it so he's like oh what did my Sarah shoe come and I said it's already come it's here and he's like where is it where is it I said you're not having it until you clean the guinea pigs out well, anyway, it worked because he cleaned the guinea pigs out. Anyway, 10 o'clock at night when he should have been in bed, he gets his sewing machine out. He can't get it to work. It's, I don't know what's going on, but it's not, it's not sewing. It's doing what it should be doing. It's got a needle threader that came with it. You know, those little round cheapy things with like a pointy bit. Well, that was broken. Um... I'll just pick one up. I think they're German home bargains in a sewing set or whatever. Not bothering to complain about that. But it, you can't get it to sew. But it, it works. It's just he hasn't set it up properly. And instead of reading the instructions, he was just having a tantrum. I want a proper one. Get me a proper machine. And I've said no. So I said, go to school, come home, and we'll read the instructions and put it together properly. And then we'll get it working kids it's quite a good little machine mine for 15 quid um but yeah so my day today is gonna be low-key boring bit of shopping you know me I like a bit of shopping does casa but i won't be spending a bomb in home bargains I think I really need, although when I went into B&M, there wasn't much I needed. So, unless I go in and my mother's in a totally funny mood and says she doesn't want to go out, I won't bother going then, although I'll have to nip to Tesco because Warren can't be without his coffee. He finishes early today. Right, that's enough talking. And uh, I will get round to doing a weigh-in update soon. One of you commented and said, we need a weigh-in update, please. Well, I'll do one when I want to do one. And that's that. It doesn't change me as a person for you to know how much I weigh. You know I don't keep it a secret how much I weigh. But, uh, yeah, I'll do one when I want to sit down and do one. When I'm in the right frame of mind. So until then, just know that I'm a fat ass. See you on the next clip, which will be either breakfast or when I'm back with my mother. I'm not filming cutting her air because I haven't bought stuff to film. Um, I'll show you before and after, though. Right, see you soon in the next clip. Roll VT. Right, I'm at my mother's now. She's looking like Sally Scarecrow. <laughs> Gonna cut your hair. You're lucky, aren't you, that I can cut your hair? Yeah. Ready for a trim? Yeah, not too short. Not too short. It's gonna be cold. Oh, right, we'll come back to you in a minute and show you the uh, end result. And there she is, freshly cut. Do you like it? Yeah, yeah, I'm a, I'm a bonnie lassie. Ah, you're a bonnie lassie. Mm. <coughs> a bonnie lassie new. Hi, there we are, all done. Wait, I'll get up. You get up, yeah, you need to take the tablets. Right, are you ready for the day or what? I need to put your sleeve and your socks and all that on. Clean my teeth. Yeah. Home bargains then, is it, later? Yeah? What What are you going, the, hem, the one up the road? Or are no, you going to go to Cardiff. Right then, say bye. Bye. Hey, good day. <laughs>
Hi guys, I uh, just had a knock at the door and it was the TikTok shop. Not at the door, but you know, my order. And Michelle will be pleased because my sweets have arrived in time for bingo. These sweets were a lot cheaper on the TikTok shop than I bought on Amazon. These are freeze-dried sweets. I got Wham Bars. There's literally two Wham Bars in there. So I'm going to take those to bingo tomorrow as a treat. Um, and calorie-wise, I'll obviously just count calories for a Wham Bar. These are... Um, what you call them? Squashies. So I'll let the kids have them and I'll literally just save two for me and Michelle. And then there's some more Skittles. They are a lot smaller than the packet I had, but we don't need a big lot of sweets, do we? Um, and yeah, I'll just save Michelle. I've tried, I've tried them. doesn't actually tell you the calories on them. Only the ingredients, but obviously I'll just go with calories of the sweets that they are. But these are www.thetreatplug.uk. But I had them on the old TikTok shop. So that's my first delivery. My first delivery. And I've just ordered from the Butty Hut because... I can't even be asked. Um, my son asked for the Butty Hut and I said no. And then I've been doing stuff and Warren's like, oh, what's for lunch? And oh, it's 5 to 12. Warren's home at half past 1. So I um, have ordered, what have I ordered? I've ordered my mother a bagel breakfast bagel i've ordered a slimming breakfast for myself i know i could have made all this myself but you know i've ordered a slimming breakfast i've ordered warren a club sandwich with cheese and i've ordered my son a loaded taco um and i've asked for it to come at half past one um once we've eaten that i'm taking my mother to home bargains i may pop into asda or aldi or something because my mother wants some fruit um I did a before and after photo of my mum and and half looks different in her hair, look. It's a bit of lesser. So yeah, that's what we're having. And then we're gonna have the pizza chicken later. So I'm gonna send a picture to Michelle now of the sweets. I'm sure she'll be pleased because she said she hadn't tried them yet. So I'll catch up with you for lunch when my slimming breakfast arrives. No, 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 no! Guys, my life just gets even better and better. I haven't eaten anything today. It's 10 to 2. A woman just turned up with everybody's food. But guess what? The bottom of the bag fell out and my slimming breakfast went all over the road. That just sums up my life. So everybody's got nice food that I've bought them and I've got nothing. So, yes. I am going to cry over food. I'm so pissed off. It's unbelievable. Anyway, cheers. I'll just have my bath hug because um, I'm not pissed off. Right, I'm just going down to my mother. She's just chasing me up as well, which has peed me off. I'm only 10 minutes after the time I said I'd be there. And she's like, I thought we were going out. I was like, oh, fuck's sake. Anyway, this is what I'm having for my food. For, for this 10 to 3 in the afternoon. And I've had enough bloody banana in these 57 calories a slice and there's three slices and just shoot me now I'm not in the mood for going shopping <sighs> I'm definitely not in the mood for going shopping stressful shop now it's raining I've abandoned my trolley like the bad shopper where have you put it? next to the car <laughs> Bet someone's looking at and thinking you lazy boss. Anyway, I don't care. Um, my mother's chowing down on a friggin' um, bar of Chocolate. what's it called? Dairy, Dairy milk. 
all through the shop. Oh, fancy that, fancy that. So we ended up in um, Home Bargains. It's only a time. Oh, you tell yourself that. We are in the Home Bargains and then right next door, like literally across there is Iceland Warehouse. So we went in there and we got everything we needed um, and more. Half the stuff we didn't need. The blinking traffic warden around here. Twice he's come and looked at my car. And twice he can bugger off. Um, right, let's get some heat in here because you're breathing too hard out of your dinosaur nostrils. You're fogging my car up, mother. Stop breathing, will you? Not literally. Although that will happen one day. But not today. Right, I'm still hungry and I'm still pouting that my dinner ended up on the road. <laughs> How funny is it? <laughs> you bloody enjoyed yours, didn't you? How dare you laugh at my food being what? on the floor. I paid for all that. I know she didn't charge me for the food on the floor. She wouldn't have dared. I just can't believe the way she went. Ah. Oh. Slimming breakfast, she said, it's all over the road. Sorry about that. And then I just shut the door and thought to myself, you bastard. And then Warren came in and I was like, there's yours. You enjoy that, won't you? And he's like, it's not my fault. And yes, it is. Anyway, I've only had that banana and the things and now I'm having this, 138 calories. And I'm going home to make pizza top chicken. And there's my mother. Well, why don't you not bother making it? Put it in the fridge for another day. And I'm like, you might have eaten today a meal, but I haven't. Do you know what? Since I put this necklace on, when I did that video, I haven't taken it off. I took it off to shower and that's it. What's a fleet wash? What's a what? Fleet Mobile wash. fleet wash. When he goes around washing fleets of cars, probably. Right, let's go back and get into all the traffic, shall we, for everyone going home from work for the weekend. Ready? Right. Let's go. Hmm, love like that. Right, right guys i am back in the house it's just gone six o'clock i need to be doing dinner but i'll just quickly show you what i picked up i um went into home bargains and food warehouse just trying to see which bags for which i'll show you what i got in food warehouse first just because the bags are closer I picked up some salt and vinegar Harry Ramsden crisps. Never seen them before. Picked them up and they are 125 calories a bag. I also bought some Seabrooks fries, cheese and bacon at 75 calories a bag. I got some Weight Watcher wraps because they were the lowest calorie ones on the shelf. 104 calories per wrap. And I don't remember them being like that. I thought Weight Watcher wraps were green, unless they're a different type of wrap. I also picked up these. Whether I'll get any, because I'll just put them with the other biscuits. But they are zero, nothing but yummy, zero milk chocolate OT Slims. They are 35 calories a biscuit. However, they are going to be tiny, aren't they, and slim. They are round, um, like a digestive, but they're really thin. And these ones are 35, and they are, what's the difference? They're OTs, they're digestives, chocolate ones. Thought I'd give them a go. And... See, I've done it again. I've got my mother's crisps. They always end up with my mother's chocolate. They're my mother's. And, yeah, they're my mother's. But, if you want to know, they're 75 calories. I'll give her a bell in a minute and tell her I got them. She can have them back when I do my uh, 
well, when I send her dinner down. Then back in the bag. And the wraps. That is that bag. And then I got some 20 calorie my Vita cracker breads. These are really nice for 20 calories, to be honest. Stick a bit of cottage cheese or whatever on them. I got some Parmesan cheese because I saw on TikTok somebody do some crispy air fryer pasta and they used this. But when I got to the till, it's out of date. Well, on the 4th, which is like three days time. I couldn't be bothered to put it back, so I just had it. So I possibly will make some over the weekend. Um, Calorie-wise for this, 100 grams is 402. So I've got that. I picked up some mushrooms to go on our pizza, chicken pizza. I got three packets of this ham because it was three packs for a fiver. And this ham is 104 calories for 100 grams. I also picked up timeout bars, 106 calories. And I got some Milky Ways. What are they calorie wise? Milky Way, 96. And two tubes of this because I couldn't get any when I was in Tesco. This used to be a pound, it's like 185 now. Warren takes that to work. Um, Primula Light, 42 calories for a 25 gram squeeze. And I picked up some dark chocolate and raspberry whip bars. That was what I had in there. What did I have in home bargain? Oh no, I had one more thing from there. These. The only other place I've seen these is in Costco. And again, these have got a really short date on them, like the 14th of um, March. However, these won't last five minutes in my house. The kids will eat them. They'll take them to school. They're little packs of two. 138 calories for a serving. This is a pack. Oh, them. Them. That's literally it. So a pack of two. Which is quite good because they're portion controlled. So that was them. Home bargain. I picked up some of these. These are Warren's favourites. It's Friday, so I got some favourite things. These are for the lemon and scampi, 131, and for the bacon, 120. So I got some of those. I got some non-stick scourers for the dishes. I got some bones for the dog. I picked up two packets of lettuce. So we're having salad tonight. Um, if it had been just us, I would have got one bag, but I don't think that would have been enough. 100 grams is 19 calories. I'm going to stick that behind me. I got some stickers, which I think I may have got for free because they were right at the bottom of the trolley when I got back to the car. Sorry, I'm bargains. Um, I got some more floor wipes. We go through quite a lot of wipes. They're just easy when there's a spillage or whatever. But I started buying floor wipes because they're bigger than a wet wipe or a surface wipe. And they were like 59p. I got two of them. There's another one somewhere in one of the bags. I got some more dog bones. There's my other wipes. I'm in there. I've got a bag of carrots. I thought I could grate some on our salad. 
Um, and of course, the guinea pigs and the rabbit. Same as skim milk, 46 calories for 100 ml. And I got some pointed peppers again, which go on our pizza. I got these, which is what I was eating in the car. 138 calories. It scanned 138 calories. It's 139 on the box. I got some cotton pads to take nail varnish off. That's my receipt. I picked up a folding ruler. Jackson's um, pencil case is looking a bit empty where he's losing all his bits. Handy bags, use them quite a bit. Um, that's ladies' things, I'm trying to see them too. A sponge, oh, that can go upstairs. I picked up these brownies, they are poppets, caramelly brownies, caramel flavour with chocolate chips. And they are 110 calories a brownie. Don't know how big they are. They're probably not very big, but I got them. I picked up some non-stick baking paper sheets, 24 sheets, and it says that they don't move around. Got them. Yeah, a bit of baking. I got that for Jackson for school. I got I got some more of this. I used it the other week to do chicken and coat chicken. It's really nice. But I used nearly the whole thing for doing everyone chicken. So I picked up another one. Um, and calorie wise, 100 grams, 340 calories. 150 grams in the whole thing. I got some sift to clean the toilets and stuff. I got some very boring morning coffee biscuits, although they're really nice and they're only 35 calories a biscuit. I got just a small pack of spare washing dishwasher tablets because we're getting low. I picked up this. I thought it was a good buy. 4 99 20 microfiber cloths. You can never have enough dishcloths. Or cloths for spillages. I also picked up this pen, very large pencil case for Jackson. Oh, and Dexter today, we had an email. He's been accepted into his secondary school first choice, which was the same as Jackson. So that was handy. Roller cling film. A monkey face mask. For me, yes. And I got a shower gel because they go through loads of shower gel. Last bag. I did actually pick up, I've left them in the boot of the car, some toilet roll. And they had Lucozade in um, the, the warehouse, Iceland warehouse. I got the pink Lucozade. And the tropical one, I think they're six calories a can. So I picked up them. I needed a new one of these because mine, again, had gone where the head won't fit on. They last for so long and then you can't get the head on. You need a new one. So I picked up a new one of them. I picked up some of these waffles for kids. They do come in packs of two. And per 100 grams, they're five. 100 calories, that's a lot in it. 272 calories in the packet. There's well over a thousand calories in, in that. I also picked up some Mayflower curry. We haven't had this Mayflower curry in absolutely yonks. 77 calories per 100 grams. It even gives you a recipe on the back look to make chicken curry so I picked up one of them I also got some 
Happy crisps. Yes, yeah, there's quite a lot of crisps I've picked up, isn't there? Um, sausage and tomato, 128. 129 for the smoky bacon and the chicken is 125. So I've got them and I picked up these for me. They are cheaper, plus 64 calories a packet. That's why I got those ones because they're lower. I also picked up this dark mint. Kids aren't that fussed on mint, but I really like mint, so hopefully they'll keep the mitts off these. 103 calories per bar. The two finger Kit Kats. And I've also just ordered a fudging fantastic. A slab of mint fudge. Yes. Which I can calorie count and incorporate. Right, last few bits, guys, because I need to get on and get dinner done. More scourers for the pans. I did want the old um, wire wool brillo -y ones, but they didn't have them, so I just picked them up. I got some pork scratchings. They're tiny little bags. And they are 97 calories. Cucumber for tonight. Bag of grated cheese. 100 grams is 416. And the last thing in this bag is three bags of these potatoes, which are upside down. And the reason I bought them is because I'm just gonna slice them in half and make some really chunky wedges to go with our pizza. But I bought three bags because um, there's not that many in a bag and that's it so i'm going to put this stuff away and go and make pizzas with chicken breasts yes and i'm aunt marvin because i haven't had a meal today yet and i'm still sulking i am still sulking <laughs> right i'll catch you for dinner and it's freaking freezing bye guys so guys this is my long-awaited dinner Pizza top chicken, some of the potatoes I picked up that I've just sliced in half and put in the kasori, some salad, pickled onions, and I've just made a yogurt and mint dressing. So that's my dinner tonight. And boy, am I looking forward to that. So guys, I am ending my night. It is half past 10 and I am going to have a munch on some watermelon. And that is me done. So I will catch you tomorrow where I'm going for a game of bingo with Michelle. So thanks for watching and I'll see you tomorrow in the next one.